You may not realize it, but there is a naval air station in northwest Florida that trains pilots from across the country, and it's not NAS Pensacola. News 5's Allison Spann gives us a rare behind-the-scenes look at the annual fleet fly-in at Whiting Field. Located just a few minutes from Pensacola, Naval Air Station Whiting Field is the training ground for every single helicopter pilot in the United States Navy, Marine Corps, and Coast Guard. 100% of every helicopter pilot in the Navy, Marine Corps, and Coast Guard ever is built right here. They showed us around some of their training facilities. This is what they call the T-6 Bravo Prop Flight Simulator. It's used as the primary flight training for Navy and Marine Corps pilots. It's been good training, and I didn't realize how good the training was until at the completion of it, because you kind of sit back and you realize that you're fully capable and confident to take the helicopter out uh, by yourself. And when I checked in, I definitely wasn't feeling that way. What you're seeing now is video I shot in the pitch dark through infrared goggles. They use these to train their pilots to fly in the dark. Today, they hosted their annual fleet fly-in. It's very nostalgic, and it's, uh, like I said, everybody started here, so it's neat for these guys to come back and uh, see many of their friends and, and kind of walk around and remember flying this little thing. Marine, Coast Guard, and Navy helicopters from across the country descended on Whiting Field. This day gives flight students the chance to fly in the fleet and make their final decisions about which aircraft they want to fly. This is actually the first time in aviation history that 51% of the aviation force is made up of helicopters, and all of those pilots are trained down at Whiting Field in Milton, Florida. Live in the newsroom, Allison Spann, News 5.